टू टू डे टू इन्फो न्यूज आई एम सृष्टि रस्तौगी एंड हेर आर अपडेट्स ऑन इंटरनेशनल न्यूज मिसाइल एक्सप्लोड इन फ्रंट ऑफ सिविलियन वॉकिंग इन की फुटेज पोस्टेड ऑनलाइन शोज द मूवमेंट मिसाइल एक्सप्लोडेड ऑन अ स्ट्रीट इन की just in front of a person walking through a nearby park on street one person was killed in a strike on a block of flats in the capital earlier on monday as russian forces continue to bombard many ukrainian cities <laughs> editor interrupts russian tv news show a woman holding an anti war sign ran on to the set of a russian evening news program on the state control channel 1 on monday evening <laughs> Businesses shut as officials widen COVID lockdowns. Several multinational companies have halted operations as China widens its COVID lockdowns, among its biggest since the start of the pandemic. <laughs> Court overturns teenagers against caste minister. The Australian government has won an appeal against a ruling that it has a duty of care to protect children from harm caused by climate change. <laughs> Britain accused of jeopardizing China's security. A British national living in the UK has been accused by police in Hong Kong of jeopardizing China's national security and told he faces 3 years in jail. Fears Russian aggression could spill into Poland with Russia's war in Ukraine raging on its doorstep. Poland is holding its breath. It feels vulnerable to two fronts as the number of refugees coming into the country swells and a military base near its border and Ukraine was attacked. West was made terrible mistake after Crimea. Prime Minister Boris Johnson has said the West made a terrible mistake and let Vladimir Putin get away with ending Crimea in 2014. Double tap attacks in Yemen civil war. While much of the world is focused on events in Ukraine, the violence in Yemen is some of the worst it's seen in the 8 years of conflict. Iran says several arrested in nuclear facility sabotage plot. Iranian state television reported Monday that the Climatarian Revolutionary Guard arrested members of a network working for Israel that planned to sabotage Iran's major underground nuclear facility at Florida. Over 100 Haitian migrants land in Florida. Keys on single boat. A total 158 people swam to shore from the vessel which was roughly 200 meters away from land. They were taken into CBP custody when they arrived and will be interviewed and processed for removal proceedings according to CBP. For further updates keep watching today to inform